Welcome to Price Plow. What's happening, Price Plow Nation? I am here with Lex the Flex Kovac. What's up, guys? Of NutriKey. <laughs> but, Lex, well, you're also holding something from Ref Sports. So, what's the story there? Man, I'm getting my hydration on right now. Uh, hydration, hydration and hy something else in there. A little bit of energy, too. Little. So, yeah. So, what's the story? <laughs> you guys run Ref Sports. Is the cat kind of out of the bag, or is it it now? At least? Yeah, it's kind of out of the bag right now. So, we manufacture all of our own goods in, in Longwood, as you guys know. Um, <laughs> We also do uh, stay classy, Las Vegas. <laughs> stay classy, Las Vegas. <laughs> That's why we do it out here. <laughs> so um, by by launching the uh, launching the energy drink, it's like a it was a, a huge market for us. And we've always done the commodities, always done the healthy healthy living stuff, and um, <laughs> it's coming. <laughs> it's coming soon. So if you guys haven't heard, the straight arm challenge is where you're gonna actually drink and raise energy all the way to the dome by not bending your elbow. So really? have, have you done it? Yeah, of course I've done it. Oh, dude. and is it on video? Yeah, absolutely. Oh, okay. I'll share it with you. Got okay, to see yeah, it. We'll, yeah. yeah, we'll share that. So we're actually doing a, we're actually <laughs> doing a giveaway. Every single week we're picking in the most creative video um, of doing the straight arm challenge uh, they're, they're, and you win a free case of Raise Energy if you, if you get picked. Okay, so what's the story behind Raise Energy? There's a ton of energy drinks out there. Yep. Why did you have to have one? Yeah, what are you doing differently? Man, it was just, it was just, we wanted to have a, 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 a horse in the race, man. We, we felt like a lot of energy drinks um, out there just had like different ingredients that people didn't necessarily want. Um, and made them feel different. So what we did is we went, we went uh, no creatine, we went no beta alanine, we went full hydration, something that makes you feel good. We went alpha GPC, you know, the nootropics are super popular right now. Right. So we went hyper focus and something that makes you feel good when you drink it. Right. Um, you know, and caffeine it, content for those who don't know. Uh, it's actually 300 milligrams time oh. released. Oh. Yeah. So time released. So, so we, is there a little bit of citrulline malate? Or not citrulline malate? <laughs> <laughs> caffeine citrate yeah. and then oh. hydrus. Okay. So you got a blend. I always yeah, like those. Exactly. Blends. Sweet. And so um, as you know, when you add when you add taurine, choline by tartrate, and also alpha GPC, mm -hmm. it extends that dopamine half-life. So there's no crash. So no crash energy, uh, you know, no headaches, no no so crash sweet. is kind of the big thing. So feel good energy and, and not overly sweet either. That's okay, so being that it's the Olympia, how many of these have you drank today so far? How many are you going to be drinking? You're <laughs> only about, energy only about, guy as it is. Only about two and a half today. <laughs> <laughs> only about two and a half, not oh, a big deal. There, 800 megs, he's getting up there. Awesome, so let's talk about flavors. Everyone cares about flavors. Yep. That's where the, that's where our reviews come in like okay whether you like 300 milligrams or caffeine or not I can't judge that for you but I can say I like this flavor and I, I do like 300 milligrams of caffeine who doesn't right yeah and so I, I've had three of the four so far and so Matt and I, I will be reviewing these and we will link back to that review or we'll uh, vice versa depending on that sounds good sounds good first. whichever one you post first yeah so what, what flavors are you most proud of if you're gonna uh, tell someone like just to the general public what's the flavor that is the one to get man the the one the one to get right now is the uh, sour gummy worms and that's like the most sought after one. I mean, that one's, it's like, yeah, that, that's, the, that's the one. It, it tastes like a, almost a, a sour, um, I, you know what, I don't want to call it any sodas out by name, but a very popular lemon lime soda that's, uh, you know, uh, it, and it, it's, it's, it's awesome, dude. It's yes, awesome. And it's, that can just pops. Like, so I got, I got all four cans. Yeah. I got two, I got two of each one from you. So I did, I, re, I put them in the fridge, of course. Got to have a cold. Like, the energy drinks are just better cold. And so that was the, the one that just popped. And I had to have that one first. And I was impressed. Like, you were? first all off, right, yeah, not enough, not enough energy drink makers are doing like some of those unique kind of flavors that we see in the pre-workout world. And I know this isn't technically a pre-workout really. No, it's it? not. It's no, an energy like, drink. It's like but, a, uh, anytime energy. Okay. So, uh, you know, a lot, of, a lot of companies went with the pre-workout and fat burners and other things like that. It was just a, another all day energy that, mm -hmm. you know, is, it makes you feel good. Right. Simple. And, and so that was the can that like stuck out. I was like, yeah. okay, you know what? Like we like our little, our unique energy, our, our unique pre-workout flavors. We've all done the blue res. We've all done right, watermelon yeah, 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 yeah. Like, all right, give me some sour gummy worms. And so I went after that, and I was, you know what? The can was gone before. <laughs> before you knew it, right? Before I knew it, yeah. Before I expected it to. So, and then one of these, when these cans have 300 milligrams of caffeine, you got to realize, like, they taste good, like yours does. Don't think you're gonna drink half the can. You know? No, <laughs> yeah. likely the whole thing's gonna be gone. I know. What's What's interesting about this is is, is we've always had like a with any product launch we've ever done, we've had like a favorite flavor. That's like the clear and concise winner. 
uh, with the Raise Energy, for some reason, I don't know why, maybe you can speak to this a little bit more, but it's like, I'll go down the street to another retail a retail partner store or in another location, and like everyone will have a different favorite flavor. Right. Like my personal favorite flavor is the uh, guava mango. Um, I, the sour gummy's great to me, but uh, the guava mango or the strawberry colada, they're actually, I like those better. But then some people are like, no, I like the watermelon frost. And it's just, it's wild. Why do you think that is with energy drinks? I don't know. Why is it so different? It, out of a can, certain flavors, like, you sometimes get the aluminum. Or something like that. You get a little bit of that metal taste, and some flavors just seem to override them better than others. And I don't know why. But for me, I, I, so I, I always like a little bit of coconut in there. So I went with the, uh, so for me, I, I like the, the watermelon, was it watermelon colada? Strawberry colada. Strawberry colada, Strawberry yeah. colada is kind of where I ended up landing. With the guava mango, is that guava mango? Yeah, guava mango, yeah. That one had more, I like this, it had more guava guava than mango, I, I thought. Like oh, yeah, for sure. It was a little sure. bit something, it wasn't just mango. No, it wasn't. Like it, I, I, The way I would describe uh, to the viewers how uh, the guava mango tastes, it really hits you in the forefront with, uh, uh, with guava, and it finishes nice and smooth with mango. So you get kind of a, a, a good level of both. I mean, there's everybody's had mango out there. Guava is that, that unique flavor, and um, you know we, we have a, a large portion of our business in Texas and California and, and Florida with those, with those tropical flavors really do this very well. This was asked, is it geographical? Absolutely. Absolutely. Right, okay, so do, what, what trends do you notice geographically? Geographically, the, the, like the guava mango would be, uh, it's huge in South Florida, or the watermelon, huge in South Florida, Texas, and uh, Southern California, but t once you go towards the Midwest or the Northeast, it's all sour gummy. It's like sour gummy really? crazy. That's um, and then, okay, uh, but then strawberry colada, of course, but um, or watermelon too. Like the more basic flavors. Uh, the the further north you go, the more watermelon too. It's it's it's. it's you, are you calling the northerners more basic? Yeah, mate. <laughs> <laughs> no, look, look. I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. <laughs> it's uh, but it's just it's wild how many different uh, different favorite flavors people have. So I encourage everybody to try multiple flavors to see which one you like the best. Okay, so what's the best way to get them? I mean, besides going to Price.com/slash/RevSports, you want to get them uh, how are you distributing them so right now we're about three weeks in and we're about in about 600 different uh, privately owned retail stores nice, congrats. I think I think by next week should be in about 800 so go, go to your favorite specialty retailer wherever you see a Europa cooler uh, you'll you'll see us in there okay so um, it's with a lot of the Europa stuff yeah 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 um, Europa is our exclusive distributor here in the United Sweet. States um, so anywhere you see a Europa cooler you should hopefully see it there sooner you could always ask uh, for it but um, yeah just check it out I mean all right and so you mentioned you mentioned Europe as a U.S. distributor. Are there plans for international with this? You know, beverage is so new to us I right know. now. I'm not really sure. Uh, I imagine there's definitely going to. We have we have retail partner chains all over the world. Um, you know, it, you'll probably see it there eventually. But logistically, we're not really sure yet. We're so new at beverage. This is like a, a new crack at it, and we're, I mean, we're really really blessed that it's, right. this thing's taken off. Yeah. Well, I often say like in the tech world and everything, version 1.0 always sucks. Just get it out there and. <laughs> And it's gonna suck, dude. Your version 1.0 does not suck. And so, Thank congratulations. The, the, the review is gonna be very positive. It's really gonna come down to like, okay, if you want this product, which one do me and Matt recommend the most? And I, I, I'm going with strawberry colada right now. That's my little uh, little teaser. Is that the one you're drinking? That's the one I'm drinking right oh, now, yeah, dude. Man, see the plug, dude. The but plug. I couldn't help. I, but I couldn't help but grab that bright green can with the sour sour gummy worm first. So that's awesome, man. Hey, we're just happy that people don't hate it. You know. You guys, you guys, well, the fight for fridge space is on. Is it an energy drink? Is it a pre-workout? This one is an energy drink, and I sure. think that's what a lot of us and a lot of our viewers do want. Like, as much as, you know, beta alanine is cool sometimes, you know what, I don't always want all that. Just give me the good taste, good energy, and everything. And so I think you guys are doing a good thing there. Oh, what are you going to do about a fifth flavor? Is there any plans of that, or is that? Or, uh, we've already got our fifth flavor done, um, and uh, we may be launching two new flavors at the same time. Uh, but any hints that we can? Is there going to be a contest? Yet. Are you going to? Can we run a contest to do something? We'll do. So, I think we'll do something. Okay. We'll do something. Uh, but uh, I, I, I think we're we're done with the fifth flavor. We want to do a dual flavor launch at the same time, and so we're 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 ironing out the kinks right now with, with flavor six. And what about uh, the straight arm challenge? What? All right. How, so, uh, how does how we started this? So it, it was funny. I was sitting in my office. Uh, it was on my on my Instagram, and I did like a little stream, just like right. 
something like that, just joking around. And um, our, our procurement manager, he's on, in the office right next to me. He's like this frat guy, and he comes comes <laughs> in my office. And he's he's like, that shit was weak. I'm like, what are you talking about? He's like, <laughs> he's like, that, that that shit was weak, dude. You got a you got a straight arm, that bitch. I was like, what is what, what is a straight arm? What are you talking about? And, um, he's like, he's like, dude, drink it with a straight arm. So uh, if you go on my Instagram, you can see like the first video. I'm like, okay, here it is. I'm like shaking like like, like, like that, and I put it all. I, I, I dump it all over my face, and, and the straight arm challenge was born. So like people, people started hashtag uh, straight arm challenge, hashtag raise energy, and like started getting all these crazy creative videos. Like there was this uh, there was this one guy who did uh, did the the Kiki challenge mixed with the ice bucket challenge mixed with the straight arm challenge. So he's like he, like gets out of the car and he's doing the Kiki challenge uh, the Kiki dance or whatever. And then his girl comes uh, as he's as he's straight arm challenge in the raise energy uh, hits him in the face with an ice bucket. Oh, nice. <laughs> like did all three all at the same time. So you know like the creative. That's just like YouTube gold right there. I know, I know. So it, it's been pretty cool. So uh, we want to get start rewarding some of these people that are making these awesome videos. Okay, so if you have like an awesome straight arm challenge, what, what can you win? A free case of Rays. Awesome. And yeah. so is it hashtag Rays Energy with two E's? Rays Energy. Yep. Hashtag Rays. Rays Energy and hashtag yep. Straight Arm Challenge. Yep. Awesome. Hashtag Rays Energy. Hashtag Straight Arm Challenge and uh, tag Rep Sports and we'll repost it and do the whole gamut with oh, you. Oh yeah, dude. Yes. Yeah. Guess yeah. having some fun. Yeah. Yeah. Why not, man? Why not? We might have to do the, the Straight Arm Challenge on our video. Come on, let's see it, man. Tuesday. All right. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> All right. So subscribe to the alerts at Priceout.com/slash Rep Sports and you can subscribe to our channel to see that review and everything. And as always, Lex. Flex Kovacs. Such Good a pleasure man. getting you. Thanks, Mike. I appreciate man. it, bro. Thanks. Welcome to Price Plow. Hey guys, what's going on? This is Lex Kovacs coming to you live from the Rep Sports World Headquarters right here in Orlando, Florida. Now I'm going to explain the brand new Rep Sports Raise Energy Straight Arm Challenge. The rules are. The arm has to be completely straight the entire time. You need to drink as much of the can as possible. It's going to be difficult, it's going to be tough, but I don't want to see any bending of the elbows, okay? No bending of the elbows or your video is going to be disqualified. So make sure you tag Rep Sports and hashtag Raise Energy and hashtag Straight Arm Challenge, and we'll see you soon.